Hi everyone. This was one of the first things I created when Final Cut Pro 10 and Motion 5 first came out. Enough if you like it, I guess. I'm just going to pass it along. It's a pretty simple little project. If you want to dig into Motion and take it apart and see what I did, it's not terribly complicated. Otherwise, I've got this set up as a generator and I've added a few new features to it. You can set the opacity, position, rotation, and scale of the slate and add a drop shadow. Everything else that has to do with text you can deal with on the text pane of the generator when you've got it selected. And so about the only thing I really need to cover is adding the sound effect which accompanies the generator but you have to manually add it so if you import files and you go into user folder movies motion templates generators uh, wherever you put this I've got this in my tutorials when you dig down inside the media folder there's a sound effect for the wood block and I've already imported it but you can just go ahead and import that into your project and find the frame when this text first appears the second line you'll notice that the clapper is shut you will select your sound effect and type the Q key and it will add it to that exact point and the sound should be synchronized. You can animate the slate by keyframing all of these items but the text is pretty much static. If you need to, you can select the text, grab a hold of the little on-screen control, and you can move the sections around to wherever you like. You can download this from a link in the description, and hope you find it useful. I've got a new Facebook page at facebook.com slash fcpxfx where you can follow as well as with my Twitter account and I've got a blog on Posterous that I'm trying to keep up with and I will add things there from time to time that might be different content than you'll find in either of these other places including YouTube. So have fun with it and I'll catch you on the next one.